is time for Tech Talk with Mark Salzman. He's been here before, and now he's here with the best spring tech. Yeah, thanks for this, having me back. Oh, man, we love having you here. <laughs> so You're ready to you geek out with me? Geek? Yeah, yeah okay. let's geek out. Tech us up. Sure, let's do that. I like that. Tech us <laughs> up. All right. So why don't we start off with smartwatches? You know, they're becoming more and more popular as there's a lot more variety and, and a lot of different designs to choose from. So I brought two different uh, examples, uh, four different examples from two companies. I've got Fossil Q and Michael Kors Access. So they're now in the smartwatch game. As you can see, some look like a traditional smartwatch, if that's not an oxymoron. You know, a touch screen that lets you, you know, uh, flick through your your texts and emails and your fitness information. Others are more analog or classic looking like this one right here, pardon the glare. So these are both from Fossil. These are Fossil Q different examples of smartwatches that of course wirelessly, there's my uh, Air Canada by the way, my uh, flight information because it shows my barcode to, to get on board a flight. So it, uh, the, some, they all work with smartwatches um, like Android or iOS, both Apple and Android. And then these are the Michael Kors ones. Again, more of a digital version here on the right. And then on the left is, it looks like a regular watch, but in fact, Denise, yes. it does have some smarts under the hood. It calculates your steps taken, your estimated calories burned, and it sends all that information to a nearby phone. Isn't that something? Yeah. They're beautiful. Yeah, they're nice, right? And again, I've had friends who said I've wanted to buy a smartwatch, but I've been waiting for them to look more like a regular watch. Right. But they like the idea of glancing down at information and getting all that fitness data captured. So the Fossil Q start at 225 and the Michael Kors Access start at 300. That's a great deal yeah. for me. Yeah, cool. So next up is uh, portability when it comes to getting your work done, work and play, if you will. And this is a two-in-one from HP called the Spectre X360. A two-in-one is both, as the name suggests, both a laptop and a tablet in one device. So it's on a 360-degree hinge, but as you can see, a very thin computer, yeah. so very light as well. And so you don't feel it when it's in your backpack or even under your arm as you're running to a coffee shop or to and from the office. So this is great for spring because you've got for your nine to five life a full-size keyboard backlit and all that to get all your work done and then for your let's call it your five to nine downtime you bend back the screen hundred uh, percent or let's say 360 degrees and then you can use your fingertips uh, to flick through Netflix or games and whatnot so uh, this is 1499 from HP and it's got the the latest Intel processor and a almost 12 and a half hour battery which is awesome that is yeah. awesome what about this little awesome right. guy? So this is from D-Link. It is called the Omno 180 Cam HD. This is a Wi-Fi camera that you would keep in your home. And no matter where you are, whether you're in another room in your home or even at the office or on the go, you can peek in on your home to see what's happening. So it's a Wi-Fi camera that uh, doesn't require a monthly subscription. It just joins your wireless connection. And then on an app, you can see your kids come home after school, giving you the peace of mind knowing that they're there safe. In fact, it's got motion detection, so the moment the kids come in the front door, for example, it, you could see, you'll be notified on your phone or give it to an elderly relative to keep an eye on them. There's two-way audio. You could talk to your pets, for example. Uh, <laughs> there's night vision. It's called the uh, Omna 180 because it has a 180 degree wide angle lens, which is great, uh, and a lot more. It's also the first Apple HomeKit enabled Wi-Fi camera. So it works seamlessly with iPhone, iPad, even Apple Watch. Uh, and it's got end-to-end -end encryption for better security. It's 269 from D-Link. Oh my gosh. Right. Now Don't. let's talk home entertainment because yes. I know we all love watching TV and it's spring so maybe we're going to watch some baseball. So this is a gorgeous new TV from LG called the E7 series television. Yeah. It's a, a technology called OLED, organic light emitting diode televisions that is so thin. Look at that. It's only four credit cards thick, believe it or not. And it more importantly, it has a stunning picture. It's got unprecedented contrast uh, ratios, which means uh, deeper blacks and whiter whites, more vibrant colors, better brightness, wide viewing angles. It's Sips rather than gulps electricity. So this is a gorgeous OLED TV from LG. Uh, again, coming out in May, and it's the E7 series. It's $49.99 for the 55 inch, and it goes up from there. So a beautiful smart TV as well, 4K quality. I can't believe how thin it is. <laughs> I know, right? And now for audio, now this can work with. Uh, speaking of LG, this will work with any TV. Uh, and this is a new sound bar called the SJ7, and the subwoofer that comes with it. But what I like about the SJ7 it is very modular. You can use it as one sound bar, so those two speakers 
side by side below or above the TV. You can put one at the back of the room for surround sound. You can stand them up vertically on each side of the TV for stereo sound if you're an audiophile and you've got a CD collection. Or you can even take it to go. It's got a built-in battery so you can play music from your phone via Bluetooth and listen to it like a Bluetooth speaker. So very versatile soundbar. SJ7 is 749. So I really like that for both home, at home and on the go. Now we have to talk about something right. that I never even knew existed, which is a robotic That's right. lawnmower. I know, I know. You were going to say it, and the audience is like, robotic what? Lawnmower. Believe it or not. And this is, we've got it here, and we've got some video to show you as well. This is the Husqvarna 450X auto mower. <laughs> so this is a, an autom automatic or robotic lawnmower that cuts your grass. You set the parameter, so, uh, it, or perimeter rather, so it won't go onto your neighbor's lawn. It has an anti-theft alarm, by the way. It'll do its thing up to an acre and a quarter, and then when it detects it's running low on battery, it'll go back to the base and charge itself up again. It can do steep slopes. It navigates around obstacles. There's an app, so you can always see where it is on a map. Uh, it's got headlights, customizable tops. It's awesome. It's it's uh, $39.99 from Husqvarna, and it's the Automower 450X. Oh, my goodness. Thank you so much for being here today. Thanks for having we me. We are all teched up, and <laughs> up next, we have Ella Bates from the Company of Women. We'll be right back.